what is going on guys welcome to bootstrap tutorial number 15 in which I'm gonna show you how you can add tooltips to your website with bootstrap now tooltips if you don't know are just little help messages which you can add to any word or a co collection of word so let's say if you want to add a tooltip to like this area word so what you can do is you can go to your file and look at the word let's just say this is here and let's say I want to add a tooltip to this word and whenever I hover it I want to show um, the user a little message so I'm just gonna enclose this in an ahref because that would be the easiest approach and the next thing you have to do is you have to write the title which would contain the tooltip which you want to display let's just say area of square is side times side why not and uh, this is your tooltip and to toggle the tooltip what you have to do is or I'm just gonna show you first what happens with just a simple tile so this is let's reload this page so you see when you hover over this for a while then you see this little ugly gray area of square is side times side which is the OS default but since we are using bootstrap this framework has its own tooltips coded already so you don't need to do anything so what you have to do is just write here data tooltip and yeah so that's pretty much it so just write data tooltip here and one thing we are left again is that you have to trigger the tooltips with the help of jQuery so for example like you added this data tooltip attribute to whichever the ahref you want to show tooltip to then what you have to do next is write a script in your jQuery file and I'm just doing this in the same file because there's hardly a line so there's no you know um, need for a new file for this and this is the document ready function and what I want to do is that if any tag contains this attribute right here I want to tooltip that tag so this tooltip is the method I guess this is in this file so I'm just gonna move this above just in case so we are all ready now let's take a look let's reload the page and hover over this Whoa, okay where's jQuery are you serious now well that is kinda weird bootstraps javascript requires jquery hmm well the jquery is present oh okay I guess I moved it over jquery as well so just make sure you to keep the order jquery bootstrap your code here you go okay now hover over the area and as you can see this nice little tooltips pops up over this area and this would automatically adjust so for example like if um, you decide to show the tooltip down the side of the word then if I like scale up or down the window then these tooltips would automatically adjust so that won't just overflow on your page and you can customize these tooltips with the CSS if you want your own CSS because you see that when I hover over this a new element is added right in there if you see in the inspect element the div, the div class tooltip and I can get to that without just leaving my mouse there and as you can see you can customize this by just adding your div dot tooltip don't customize it by ID because that seems like this is randomly generated or in a sequence but you get the point so you 
can just change the background to a bit or I guess we are not supposed to work on this element yeah so this one's good so you can change the background or the opacity of the tooltip or what you whatever you want to do okay so go ahead and try this out and um, yeah so that's pretty much it for the tooltips and I'll see you then next time don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching